hello guys now that you're feeling comfortable in your corridor environment and you already understand the types of images talking about the vector and the bitmap images now it's time to start creating some new pages so we're going to learn how to create a blank document as well as getting a little help from our templates available to us in corridor x theory so don't mind what we already have on the screen it doesn't matter because we're going to be closing that up right away so I'm just going to close it no saving changes because I already have this place before now so close it out there you go now this is Corel draw environment without a page to work with and as you can see most of the tools they are unavailable to us because we don't have any active file to work on so there are so many ways to create a blank document one we already talked about before talking about our welcome screen where you have your new day and choose from templates as well here you have this on the file menu you see new see new from template these are the two ways you can create device we're going to be creating so for the blank document let's just use this first let's click on it and before you know it your blank file is already created though not named yet but the most important part is that the file itself has been created so you notice that it comes with a default setting as you can see it's showing later here assuming you want to use any of other formats assuming it's lega tabloid a4 a1 assuming any of the format you want to use you can from here change it and note assuming you have like four pages and you don't want this later or probably you want it but you want a different orientation landscape the moment you change it to landscape every one of them changes to landscape assuming you want this first one to become portrait the way you want the way it was initially when you created it and the other to landscape there you come to this setting here saying set default or current page size orientation only if you click on this and you decide to change this to landscape if you come here you see that both are still retaining their landscape while only the first one is portrait that is how you can play around with this from the default setting to make it a customized one now the in terms of the measurement cent to inch you can change yours to millimeter Pascal points, points, pixel, dotted, whatever you want it, yards, miles, as the case may be, even in meters. But let's just leave that in inches. And every other thing here is not new. You just need to know what is happening. So, as it is, this is a way you can create a, a blank document. The other way is through the welcome screen. And here on the welcome screen you have new you have new from template as well so here we're just gonna click on the new and this is another way of creating this same file itself and assuming they are all closed out you can also use ctrl n which is the shortcut for creating new new document or new blank document if you use ctrl n which I already pressed on my keyboard it still gives you the same thing and talking about our second option which we are going to be using as well in this course of this tutorial which is new from template let's just dive into that and, see, and pick the option here there you go these are the options you have you say full page labels, envelopes side fold, web browser as the case may be for full page you have all this type available to you for usage now for labels these are the 
the ones available for you to use so for envelope you can see all these are the templates available for the side fold you have all these available to you which you can easily make do of though you can create your own template but these are all available ones for your browsers you can see all this these are the ones already created initially which is for the browse this web you have few templates already in place they are more like your website template with a navigation bar your header and all that in place so if you are to choose any of these assuming we want the one for web let's just say something of this nature and we click ok you just wait a little and the next thing you see is that it's creating there you go it has already created the template for you so this is basically the template it says content goes in here and all that into the body here you have your toolbars and all that and if you zoom in you see that all these are contents for the navigation itself so this is just how you can create a new document using this format itself so this is basically on how you can create a new document we'll be working on something more comprehensive in the next tutorial but this is all you need to know basically on how to create a new or blank document see you in the next tutorial